He's Joshua. She's Jeanette. And this is Right Left Together. It's Thanksgiving, so it's time for the annual pardoning of the turkey at the White House. I love Thanksgiving, and I love how this holiday is a few weeks after Election Day. Folks are tired of politicians, they're tired of polls, they're ready for poultry. <laughs> I love this event too. You actually get to see the personality of the president in the pardoning. It humanizes also, them, right? Yeah, it and it also them. symbolizes the start of the holiday season for the country. Yeah. But it shows who you are. My favorite was President Barack Obama. He really did those dad jokes well. He did the corny <laughs> ones, the puns. No way I'm cutting this habit, cold turkey. He was on brand, I love that brand. You're all about the dad jokes. You're a cornucopia of dad jokes. A gravy train of dad jokes. <laughs> but I like how President Trump took, used it to take shots at his opponents when he was under impeachment. Big surprise. Yeah, he said bread and butter, you know, they're gonna be calm and cool when they get subpoenas from the congressional Democrats. Well, the pardon shows who the president is, and the year before that, in 2018, he's pardoning a turkey named Carrot because Carrot wouldn't accept the election results. Oh, I don't know, he's the turkey in the coal mine for Trump. A couple years later, Trump wouldn't accept the results. Seriously though, some presidents use this as a serious tone, yeah. right? It's not all fun and games. President George W. Bush, a couple of months after 9-11, used this as an opportunity to bring our country together. So where do these turkeys actually go when they're pardoned? I heard they went to Disneyland in That years. sounds like fun, but I also heard they went to Frying Pan Park, which sounds like a terrible place for turkey PTSD. Yeah, I don't think that sounds like much of a retirement. So where do they go, Joshua? Well, they used to go to Mount Vernon, the home of uh, George Washington, but now they go to... Gobbler's Rest at Virginia Tech, which sounds like a much better place than being on our Thanksgiving table. Like where the Golden Girls might go. <laughs>